Here we go, guys. Garden Warfare 1, where it all began just over 10 years ago. It's, it's mind-blowing that it's now 10 years and a couple of days since Garden Warfare 1 was released. And I remember doing YouTube as a bit of a hobby back in the day, doing Minecraft videos, Call of Duty, and then getting Garden Warfare 1. And I fell in love with the game instantly. We are going to be doing an hour, that is right, one hour video of Garden Warfare today to celebrate 10 years of this amazing game. And arguably one of the best games Plants vs. Zombies has ever made. I personally think Garden Warfare 2 just tops it, but then Garden Ops, Garden War. I personally think Garden Warfare 2 just tops it. However, Garden Warfare 1 being the original third person shooter is absolutely incredible. So we're going to be doing a bit of Garden Ops. We're going to be jumping into some multiplayer. And we're going to be going all the way back to where it first began, which is Garden Ops, the first game I ever played. And I remember, to this day, I don't know why I remember. I just know we was on Port Scallywag. And I know playing as the normal pea shooter, because back then, I knew we had sticker packs. But I had no idea that there was the character versions and stuff like that. I just thought it was, oh, it's Pea Shooter and stuff like that. I thought that's all it was. I didn't realize we had all of these variants that you could unlock in the game. So when I finally got them, which I honestly can't remember which my first character I unlocked. Was it might have been the Arctic Trooper? Um, I was like, oh, there is more to this game than I initially thought. But we do have Garden Ops here. I remember just going on to Port Scallywag. I think I might have been on any. It threw me on Port Scallywag, and I remember playing as the normal pea shooter, and I just remember shooting at one of the brown coat zombies, and its head just popping off, and I found it absolutely hilarious. And I have told this story before, but I will tell it again just because it is 10 years. Uh, if you guys do not know, Garden Warfare 1 was the first time I ever played Plants vs. Zombies, and I actually hadn't heard of Plants vs. Zombies until I got this. And essentially, I had some money left over. One of my friends messaged me and was like, Hey, I'm going to be buying the new Xbox One today. I think it was his birthday. He's like, do you want to come along? And I was like, yeah, I'll come along. Decided to actually get myself an Xbox One at the time as well. Um, so it was there. I remember me and my friend buying the Xbox Ones in uh, Game, which is one of these stores in the UK. And I remember a couple of kids behind me was like, Oh, they've just bought new Xbox Ones. Because the console had only been out. Um, a couple of months, something like that. I didn't get it at launch, but I picked one up there and then. And one of my friends was like, you should get it with Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. The game looks amazing. So I was like, all right then, that sounds cool. So I ended up picking it up with Garden Warfare. I ended up getting Dead Rising 3. And I got another game as well, but I can't remember what it was. It was sort of like the bundle that we had going. And I played a little bit of Dead Rising 3. And then I played this game and fell in love with this game. And I made a video on this map as well. My first video was also on this map. Never mind my first actual time playing this game was on this map. But I remember my first video was Boss Hunt. We had my friend iLogix in there as well. Talking about Boss Hunt. Everything that you needed to know about it. I didn't really know a lot back then. But hey, we made a video on it. And then my second video, which actually blew up, was uh, how you could get a lot of coins in the game as well. And that one definitely definitely helped the channel out that's for sure and i just remember refreshing my youtube page and just like a subscriber i'd be gained and i made over a, i got over a thousand subscribers and i was going crazy it was absolutely incredible but we are here on port scallywag and i used this garden here this is the actual first one i i, I had and don't tell me don't don't ask me why i have no idea how we unlocked, uh, how I remember so much. I honestly have no idea how I remember this, but I know I played on this map. I know I planted this garden and I just remember just, just playing it. Probably didn't actually pass. I think it probably would have been a normal difficulty. May have thrown down like a normal pea shooter here and there, something like that. Might not have even done that because I don't even know if I had any potted plants at the time. But for now, let's just throw down some normal pea shooters and we'll put a couple of skirtish rooms down here as well. Because why not? And let's actually see if we can beat this. I mean, it has been a while since I've played this game. But, you know, we have 
only got it on normal difficulty, so it is possible. It is possible. I'm not going to be going too crazy on the plants. I'm not going to go for, like, the laser beans or the bamboo shoots or anything like that, because those weren't even in the game at the time. But I just remember, it was like, oh, okay, we have, a we have a pirate zombie. And I just remember shooting them, and their head popping off like that. I was like, oh, my God, that is brilliant. I love that. It was so good. It was so good. I just thought this, this game's hilarious. You know, there are still so many people that play these games to this day. And in the grand scheme of things, it's a third-person shooter where you can be quite competitive. But it's got that humorous aspect to it that I think we just all absolutely love. You know, it, the game doesn't take itself too seriously. It's it's just such a such a good game. I absolutely love it. But let's go and take down these boils. Let's go take down our old foot soldier friend. Is that stink cloak going to get me? Yes, it is. Look at that. Look at that for a shot. What an absolute pro. Coming in with your stinky smoky cloud. How's our other plants hanging up? You guys doing a good job? Oh, yeah. You're doing a good job. Proud of you guys. Let's go. Let's go slow these down before they get my scaredies, before they get too scared. All right. There we go. Oh, we're all good. We're all groovy. Let's go. Let's heal ourselves up, though, a little bit. But yeah, we're going to do this one ops game, and then I think we're going to jump into some multiplayer as well, because who doesn't love a bit of multiplayer? The guys are icky. Don't let them hit me. All right, then. So there's, I think this might be one of the levels where you go against, like, the coffin zombies and stuff. I think they're all quite slow zombies. Oh, no. Never mind. We get some normal zombies, too. I'll just make sure to save my hyper, then, for when I need it. There's actually not that many zombies left, surprisingly. Yo, I'm so used to, like, when I do play this now, I'm so used to trying to do, like, crazy ops mode or something like that, that I know we've only done three waves, but it's pretty easy to start off with, you know? And I'm also considering doing a live stream or two on this game as well. Not just this game, I'm going on for two. Maybe we'll throw back a couple of live streams, and those will be probably on YouTube uh, rather than Twitch, or maybe we'll do both because I can actually do both now. It's not against the laws to stream on YouTube and Twitch at the same time. I'll just need to look into how I'm going to do that exactly. Because I, I could use Restream, but I'm wondering if there's a way I can do it a different way. We'll uh, we'll have a look. We'll, we'll figure things out. But yeah, I do want to do some live streams on YouTube. Mainly related to like PVZ and things like that. Um, but I can also stream on Twitch at the same time as well. But I, I do want to do a couple of PVZ streams on the old channel go back to our roots if any of you guys then want to come and play you're more than welcome to do so but man this takes me back i know i, I play this game every now and then but it is crazy it is crazy that it's 10 years 10 years and two days since this game came out essentially when my channel initially started like i did make content before that but that this is when this is like the game that i was known for this was when I started properly making content, putting a lot of time into it, a lot of effort. And uh, I just want to say thank you to you guys that, first of all, anyone that has subscribed in the last couple of years and, and you enjoy my content, thank you. But also anybody who's been around since the beginning. I know some people have watched me since the original God of Warfare and, you know, 10 years now. That's crazy. That is a long time. I need to heal up because this barren boy is going to be hurting me. I should also get rid of that tombstone. That could be a problem as well. Oh, well, there goes me sunflower boy. Oh. Let's get rid of this. There we go. Alright. Sunflower, down you go. I need some health. Thank you kindly. And then let's go get Barony Boy. Oh, well, I can't get Baron Boy when it just when he disappears like that, can I? Come on, Baron. Are you gonna spawn in you zombie dudes? Are you gonna spawn in you zombie dudes? Yes, no, no, yes. Well that's just that's just not fair, is it? Because I'm over here chilling in my Gatlin, and you're over there! What's that all about, huh? So I'm in my Gatling. I'll just do this. 
ah, 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 ah. Take that, Baron von Bats. My sunflower's still alive as well. Nice. Right, let's get some more of these guys in. But yeah, 10 years since I started properly making content. Thank you so much for everyone that has stuck around. Watch the content. You know, I do enjoy playing other games. I know I have tried other games on the channel. It's not necessarily something you guys enjoy. Which, you know, that can be down to me as well. But I want to say thank you to you guys that have supported me over the years. It, uh, it really does mean a lot. And uh, I do want to still make content for you guys. I want it to be something that you guys enjoy. And I thought for 10 years, let's just sit down. Let's just play this game for an hour. You guys enjoy it. You're more than welcome to watch as much or as little as you want. You know, I'm here. I'm just vibing. And right now, all I want to do is just sit down, play this game, and chat to you guys. I think that's... I think that's a good enough reason, right? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Let's go take you down. Oi, scientist! Get out of here! I ain't seen you reloading, sir. Yeah, I've done that. Scientist, my... My repeaters are taking care of them for you. Let's throw through Gatlin's in. Let's do that. There we go. What wave are we on? Are we going to wave 7 now? I think we're going to wave 7. Man, this is breezing through. Absolutely breezing through. Let's take these guys down. Hopefully no tombstones. Let's get a old chili bean bomb. Did you guys know that my chili bean makes you scream? That's almost 10 years old as well now. Oh, jeez. I think it's September. Don't get rid of my sunflower. I think it's 10 years in September, that, 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 that parody. That's crazy. 10 years of almost the parody. And I did say I was going to make a second one, and I never did. I'm sorry. Maybe we'll still do that. 10 years of Plants vs. Zombies. A remaster. You know, we'll we'll go like Taylor Swift. You know what Taylor Swift's like re-released their albums and it's called like Taylor's version? Maybe we'll do We're Never Alone 2024 Zero's version. And it's just a new version of the same song. Hopefully this time I don't get a copyright strike on the first day. And I can actually make money through it. <laughs> I'm joking, guys. I'm joking. I didn't do it for the money. What did we get there? What soldier? Get out of here. Okay, so I'm almost dead. So that's a coffin zombie. Maybe before I destroy the other vases, I'll I'll heal up a little bit. Honestly, I don't really care too much about the challenge. Do I get more time when I break vases? I'm gonna go down here. Oh! Oh, we just missed that. Gotta get myself a sunflower. Alright, we're all good now. Don't think I'm gonna get these vases done, though. It's gonna be close. If I can just get a line. Nope. Now we don't. Oh, well. It's all right, guys. It's all good. Where's this random zombie then? There's probably like one coffin zombie or something walking at like snail's pace. I don't know. Here's a sneaky one. Oh, scientists, where'd you come from? Maybe they came from the vase. Possibly. Either way, we did it. We did it. Well, we didn't do it because we didn't actually get the level done. But shh, that's fine. We didn't do the challenge, but it's okay. Come on, son. Come on, sunflower, give me more health! Give me more, I want more! Give me, give me, give me my son from healing. Thank you. Alright, chili bean, in you go. All right, simmer down, Mr. Allstar. Don't don't sprint tackle me. I've not seen any of the uh, the 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 the. You know, like the American footbally ones that have got like the black horns on and stuff that just charge at you. That's all they do. I forgot what they're actually called, but I haven't seen any of those surprisingly. 
Come on. Come on. I'm kind of blocking my, my repeater from hitting her. Probably not a smart choice, is it? Now, wouldn't it be great if we finish off this third level? Wouldn't it be great if we got a super wave? Imagine that. That would just be fate, wouldn't it? Getting a super wave for our final wave of the ops? That'd be kind of cool. Give me a super wave. I'm gonna go with some heals. Come on, super wave, super, super, super wave. Come on, come on. Oh. Ah. Ah. I don't mind the Yeti. I wanted the Yeti wave though, where it does the dun 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 dun. That would have been great. Would have loved that. Oh, scientist. Nope. Don't wave at me. Don't you dare wave at me. Rude. Yeah, she's almost dead too. Oh. That's just cheating, isn't it? Hang on a minute, guys. Hang on a minute. Let me just let me just plop down a sunflower. Alright, we're just gonna plop down a sunflower. We're gonna throw this down. I do need to get rid of this tombstone though. Let's do that. Alright, I know there's a brown coat there behind me that's hitting me in the face, but I wanna get rid of that just so it's done and out the way. And then all we got is our Disco Stew. Who's surprisingly already on half health. You gonna do it? You gonna do it? You gonna do it? Oh, I thought he was gonna do his swing! My plan's taking him down, look at that! If I could give you a love tap, I would. I'd give you a little, give you a little tap on the head. Good repeater. You did a good job. Good Gatlin. You did a good job. Oh yeah, the landing zone! Highway to the landing zone. Gotta get you right on to the landing zone. I'm actually curious. If you end up taking down tombstones, do you just end up having just less zombies after you? Like, if I just chill up here like this. If I just slowly take these zombies down, do I just have less risk of dying? I am curious about that. Can we take the tombstone down from here? No. But we can hit these guys from a long distance. Oh, we got more over this way, though. I can hear them. Wait, my pea shooters are still attacking them over there! Oh, they're doing such a good job! Hey! Get out of there. Nope. What if I go all the way to the end here? Is the AI smart enough? Look at all the potted plant vanquishes there. I'm proud of you guys. Are you smart enough to come over here? I don't think you are. You're walking backwards. I don't think they know what to do. Oh, I can hit the tombstone here. Hey, let's go. I'm not cheating at all, guys. I'm just, I'm just playing the game. There's another tombstone right there as well. Hi, tombstone. Don't mind me. I'm just chilling over here. Doing what we do. We all gravy. You guys can have a sunflower. There you go. How about that one? We successfully escaped. Who knew going on the top of the boat would have actually been the strategy? The zombies didn't know what to do. They didn't know what to do. There's that coffin zombie that shot his little laser at me for a second. And then he just kind of slowly walked backwards and was like, you know what? You're in a superior spot. I've got the disadvantage. I'm just going to head out of here. But there we go. There is ops. The first time I ever did ops on Port Scallywag, we do manage to win. Surprisingly, we managed to win because you never would have expected me to win on normal difficulty. Definitely not. But... We have still got time in today's video, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna jump into some nice, juicy multiplayer.
We're going to go on gardens and graveyards. How can we not? Let's jump into it and let's go find ourselves a really great game. Look at that. Instant. Instant one. As long as it doesn't put me on the crash course, we're fine. Because typically if no one's playing, it throws you on crash course and then you just kind of screwed. You're just on your own. We found it straight away. I remember being really sneaky as well and just like sneakily just defusing the, the bombs at the end of this one if you're on the zombies. I loved it. It was great. This is a great level. I love it. Honestly, most gardens and graveyards maps are great on this level. Are all of them good? I think they're all good. They've all got their perks. Driftwood Shores, great. Walnut Hills, great. Not as good on Garden Warfare 2 because of the new classes and stuff like that. Main Street, great. I do actually like Cactus Canyon. I think that's a great one as well. Can't remember if there's any more or not, though. Cannot remember. But look, let's jump in straight away with boss mode. Oh, look at that. Look at that. We got the old boss mode. This was the version, essentially, of... Sort of bringing in the mo mobile, like the mobile version of the game. Into the game. So you could kind of play this, I think, on like a, a smart tablet or something like this. And you could still play and be involved. No one's actually attacking us yet, which is kind of nice. But don't really use boss hunt too much. It's not the greatest. However, I do love it. I know I'm kind of think, where are we? We're on the diner. So, okay, so the teleporter is going to be over here. So for now, I'm going to... Um, let's put an earth strike down here. See if that gets anyone. Come on, come on. Oh! Hey, you know what? That wasn't too bad, though. Let's throw down a spotter here. I think that's what just kind of tells the the team where they are. And then we're also going to throw in a... Should I do a cheeky little resurrect here? Or should we do a double heal? Let's do a double heal here. There we go. Oh, no. They all died. Do I have enough points? Do I have enough sun? Nope. I need a little bit more sun. Oh, look at all those zombies over there. I just want to get an earth strike right on their faces. Right there. Probably not going to kill anything, but you never know. You never know. There's one standing right on it. There was a cherry bomb in his face. Yes! I got someone. I killed them. Look at the dead body right there. Oh, I love that. I love it. We're doing a good job. We're not really doing much action here, but no one's actually shooting at our boss hunt right now. So... That's okay. Uh, let's throw down. Let's throw down a heal here. That pea shooter looks like he needs a little bit of double health. Let's give him some health. Yep, there he goes. Look at him healing. He's getting those heals in there. Don't worry. I got gotcha. you. I'm the best. The best boss hunt. Boss hunt. Boss mode player you've ever seen in your entire life. Look at all these points that we've got. We're loving it. We are absolutely loving it. We've got these two over here. Uh, we have lost a friend there. Uh, probably shouldn't have put an airstrike down there, actually, because I think they died. But I guess it takes a little bit of uh, takes a little bit of pressure off them. Absolutely fine. Can I get a resurrect in there? Can I get a resurrect in there? Did that resurrect them? Maybe it did. Maybe it didn't. I don't think it did. All right, I'm going to throw a spotting down here. Just so you all know, that's exactly where they are, guys, okay? They're all over in that area. That's where every single one of them is. Just make sure you get in them. Oh, I so wish I had the airstrike right now, though. That would be so good. We've still got that sunflower in there as well. Nope, sunflower's down. Oh, that resurrector's got such a large cooldown. I do want to get rid of that teleporter, but I also want to try and take these guys out as well. Uh, I'm just going to throw it down here in the middle. Smack bang in the middle. They get the gooped. We can take out that engineer. We destroyed a healing station. Not really ideal. Let's quit for now. And let's go as... I kind of want to go as a... I want to go as a jade cactus. I do like the jade cactus. We're going to... We're going to chill at the back. We're going to kind of snipe them down. We obviously know where their 
um, where the teleporter's going to be. And we can do a decent amount of damage here as well. With our little splash damage too. Let's go get these zombies out here. Don't you be taking them down. Alright, I'm going to chill. Can I get you from here? Oh, oh, I see you being over sneaky over there. Can I get you? I can, but you can also get me, which is not a good thing. I'm just going to drop down here like this. You didn't see a thing, guys. You didn't see a thing. We only got 30 seconds left. Maybe we'll kind of chill back here for a minute. Let's get our drone on the go. Thank you for the heal, Sunflower. I do appreciate that. I want to just hide. I want to keep my drone kind of hidden just in case the zombies do a last late second charge. We can throw our corn strike on there and then take them down. We're just going to wait for it. We're going to wait for that last second charge because that's what they always do. They're like, oh, we got two seconds left, guys. Charge the field. All right, let's use it now. They, they, didn't, they didn't go for a last minute charge. They didn't do it. But you know what? The only reason we won that entire game was because of my boss mode. We got a vanquish with the earth strike. We healed peeps up. We let them know where the zombies were. We absolutely smashed it. It's not that on stage PL happened to get 51 vanquishes and four of the six boasts. It's nothing to do with that. Not at all. Also, why is everybody got a question mark? Why is everybody got question marks? Is this a bug in the game now? Like, uh, is this like a a privacy setting or something where people have question marks? What's that all about? I've never seen that before. Like, I can still click the view gamer card and I can still see the the gamer card. So I still can still see what the name is, but I have no idea what the question marks are. Fair enough. Fair enough. That's okay. That's okay. Be individual though. Look at that max rank. We love it. We love it. We love the max ranks. We've still got a lot of new people here as well. Look at that. We got rank 28. We got rank 30. We got rank 60. There are a lot of new people that still play this game. Did not actually realize that many new people play this game. Guys, if you're new to Garden Warfare, let me know how long you've been playing. I want to know. I want to know. Have you been playing for two weeks? Have you been playing for two months? Have you been playing for two years? Have you been playing everything? Let me know. Let me know what you've been playing. Because I want to know. I want to know how long you've been playing Blacks vs. Zombies Garden Warfare for. And here we go. We are the Foot Soldier. I think we can't not. I think we've got to go as the busted, broken, super commando. How can I not? Everybody's name's no longer a question mark now. Maybe it was just a lobby thing. But we've got... Four max ranks on our channel. We love to see that. And we are playing as the old Super Commando. You know, this is my... I loved this character going initially. Didn't really aim in too much. I just kind of just hit fight a lot of the time. Didn't mean to do that. Meant to go forward. Meant to do that. And we pick up the first strike. Let's go. We love that. So I'm kind of like a roof guy. That was my whole playstyle was was being the old roof guy. You kind of jump on like this roof here and you just kind of kind of pick them off from the old side where they don't expect you to be, like so. If I could actually hit my targets. That one should hit. There we go. What about this cactus? There we go. Oh, Agent P could be a threat, but down they go. Not today, Sunny Gem. All right, we're on fire. We're going to back off a little bit. We're going to bring out ourselves a Harry the Healer. I've only surprisingly got 45 of them because they are the greatest zombie in the world. There is nothing that beats a Harry the Healer. There we go. Not a bad start to the game. We got ourselves, like, what was that? Like, seven vanquishes or something, I think? Damn it. I forget that there's no shared vanquishes in this, though, so you actually need to finish off the guy. 
Otherwise, you don't get a vanquish. How are you not dead? There we go, down they go. I need another Harry the healer. Yo, Harry, where you at, my homie? Harry! Harry! Come on, Harry! Oh, come on, Harry! Alright, get out of here, Agent P. I know you see me over there, I also see you too. I'm gonna go for a risky ZPG. Doesn't work. You're so weak! Oh, I think that's probably the Agent P coming for me. There's a sunflower there too. Uh, let's get on this roof. Mm. Oh, sunflower's in the beam. Look at that. Look at that. There's another there's another another objective down. You know what? I do like some you know, sometimes I can do the objective and that's fine. But then other times I like to just go in there. Not really go for the objective, but just focus on taking them down. Because if you take them down. Oh. If you take them down, then that means that you. Damn it. Fair enough, Agent P. I think they were probably on a lot of health anyway. Yeah. Um, if you take them down, then that's more, that's less pressure that they have defending the garden. How many vanquishes we got? We got 10. We got 10. Two of our max ranks actually swapped team. They ended up swapping over to the other team. Right, let's throw a stink cloud in there. Do a little bit of damage. You have berry shooter, so you do have big splash damage, but that's okay. We take them down. Oh, I see you, Agent P, up there. I see you trying to get on top. Are you going to go into your Gatlin? Go on, do it. Don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. Shoot. They moved! The slippery devil. I will come and get you this time. Mark my words. Can I hit my targets? There we go. We got him. Oh, that's a Sombrero Beam Bomb over there. That's not going to kill, but it... Oh, it didn't even do any damage. Gotcha that time, Agent P! Ha ha ha! What about this Snow P? Nope. Let's throw a Stinky Boy down there. Nope. Completely whiffed that one, didn't I? Oh, he got me back. Go on, Brown Coat! Take him down! Take him down, brown coat. So he's playing a very powerful character on the plants. I'm playing a very powerful character on the zombies. And you're my nemesis. I have 13 Vanquinios. Don't know why I said it like that, but why not? Oh, you're back up there, I see. Is that your spot, huh? Is that where you want to be chilling today? Is that an AFK pea shooter? Doesn't matter. They're dead anyway. I do hear a pea shooter. Is he still up there? Is he still up there? I don't think he is. I do want to try and get this one. Give me the berry. There we go. And there was a sunflower around, but I don't know if they've died or not. Sounds like an Agent P vibe. Nope, that's a berry. Holy Jesus, what got me then? I have no idea what actually got me then. Oh, 
Oh, nice shots there. Maybe we'll mix it up a little bit. Maybe we'll mix it up from Super Commander. We got 15 Vanquishers. Let's swap it up a little bit. Let's go as... Should we do it? Should we do it? Should we do it? What abilities have we got? GT Station Warp Mega Heal Bomb. Uh, I'm going to go and throw on the Sticky Explody Ball, I think. Let's go Marine. I know Chemist is also up there. But we're going to go for Marine. Got a little bit more of a ranged attack. Taking down drones. I think it's a slightly faster rate of fire as well. The trade-off is it just doesn't do as much damage. All right, let's throw some sticky balls in there. Oh, I got to reload. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just spraying and praying. I'm spraying and praying. I'm not going to be good against him with his agent P. When they're kind of flailing around. But if we can get nice and close, we can do a, a, a chunky amount of damage. I know they were on a roof somewhere as well. This plasma P is still good. Let's throw down. Oh, 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 oh. Don't worry, I got you, buddy. Is that Agent P still around here? Because that person's just died over there. Yes, they are. Alright, we got one of them. The other guy is above me. Is that a boss? Someone's in boss mode. Did they die? Did they die in boss mode? Oh, they died in boss mode. Wait, that's not the Agent P. That was a different boy, oh. Yeah, Agent P, Agent P, I think, got away. Or died somewhere else. Hmm. All right, don't use the teleporter because I don't know which side we're on. I personally like going this way. That toxic PC meh? Probably. Teleporter is this way anyway. Okay, at least we know. At least we know. Oh, no. That Agent P must have been weak as well. I think I was just out of, like, max range of doing, like, a, 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 a bit amount of damage. That's okay. That's all right. Everything is hunky-dory, apart from when you see a sunflower. In his thingy. Oh. That's my own thing. That's you're who I wanted. <laughs> I'm shooting my own bot thing. There we go. Nope, nope. Use the rock. Use the rock. That's right, drone. You take him down. Oh, it could have been a drone, not a boss boss thing that took him down. It could have been the the drone. That's also a factor. Damn it. We clock ties at the same time. That's what we did. How are we doing? We got 25 vanquishes. Let's go. And we just captured that base too. Nice. We love that. Wait, let me stick you. Let me stick you. Eh. Ah, oh, it was just short. Oh. There's a guy right there. Yes. Oh my God. Did you see that? I stuck my sticky ball to a zombie. And then the zombie ran over to whack him and it exploded it. It was great. Hey! Bye! <laughs> Pichu is probably on that roof. If I was an Agent P, I would probably hang on that roof. Alright there, that's also somewhere where they could hang. Oh, 
Oh, oh, that would be a that would be a chomper right there. That would that would be a a, a chomper Rooney right there. Yeah, it's not good when you come across a chomper right in your face, is it? I know I didn't die to the chomper, but still, let's go in a barrel zombie. Let's do it. Let's do it. And I want to try and sneak in if I can. Hey! You just got rid of my heal station, man! They weren't moving. That was weird. They were not moving. That's for this. There was like five Sombrero Beam Bombs around there. I had no idea which one to avoid. Come on, Pro Gamer! Come on, Pro Gamer, you legend! You absolute legend. Let's get this hill station down. Let's throw some sticky balls on there so that nobody knows where anything is. Coming for you, Sunflower. I'm getting you, Sunflower. And I see another one. Let me stick you. Okay, I didn't stick you, but... Are you still alive? Yes, you are. Everyone's still alive there. Holy crap. There's everything everywhere! Alright, we got this. We got this. I have faith. I have faith in the zombies. I do have faith. Let's go do the old flank along the side. Oh, that's a lot. Of, that's a lot together there. There's a double sticky ball kill. Alright, then we just got a... Got a casual four vanquishes, as you do. Somebody is in boss. And... Oh, you didn't know I was there, did you, scientist? A scientist? Peace shooter. You didn't know I was there. You was going for the cheeky chomp revive. I wasn't even on much health. All I needed to do was fire once and I would have been dead. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Where am I going? I'm going this way. Okay, I see a uh, peace shooter. And it's Gatlin. It also sees me. Can I hit you? Oh, I can! Come on, buddy. Are you gonna beat me? Not at that range. We've already got a zombie through the mansion. Screw the walnuts or anything like that. Let's just get in the mansion. <laughs> I kind of want to wait for my heal station to come up. I'm going to heal this up as well. There's still a pea shooter chilling down there. Look at that. All right, I want to heal this up. There we go. Oh, it doesn't... It doesn't heal the station. Never mind. I thought it would do. It does not. All right, then, I guess we're going to charge forward. Hey, guys. No, I didn't even get any of the kills. I was trying to sneak in there and get some of the kills, and I didn't. Engineer comes in and gets in the way. Oh, well, that's okay. We need one more Zombarinos. Do I actually play an objective here? I do not. I do not. I do not go into the mansion. But hey, we did good. We did good. We did all right. Wasn't too bad, was it? Wasn't too bad at all. Are we in here somewhere? Are we somewhere around here? Oh, there I am. I saw myself briefly for a, a, a smidge of a second. A smidge of a second. And I did also say that this video was going to be an hour long. 
I know we're only like 45 minutes in, but I think I'm gonna leave the video there. If you guys want to see more Garden Warfare, let me know. It also has just been eight years of Garden Warfare 2. So if you want to see more Garden Warfare 2, let me know. And I still want to finish up Battle for Neighborville. But I do want to do a few live streams, so keep an eye out for those. But uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. Ten years of Garden Warfare is absolutely crazy. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for hanging out. And thank you so much for the support. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Zero, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.